What's going on everyone? In this video, I will be talking about Real Debrid and most importantly, why you should enable this on your Kodi setup as well as how to do that. Real Debrid, or however you pronounce it, has been around for a while. I am now getting back into it because quite frankly, Kodi sucks without it. Using Real Debrid can improve your experience greatly and make Kodi feel similarly to Netflix without spending too much money. That being said, Real Debrid is a paid service, but don't worry because it is fairly cheap and very much worth it. To get started, I will answer what Real Debrid is. Real Debrid is a paid service that gives the user premium access to many popular file hosts on the internet. These are typically not available to users without it. When pairing this with Kodi and the use of third-party add-ons, you will get more reliable available links with minimum to zero buffering while also having access to higher quality links with 720, 1080, and even 4K content. Not a lot of people will want to use this for for the fact that it is not free and you can already watch content without it although not reliably the reason i decided to get back into using this service was because lately i was spending too much time looking for working links rather than actually watching content after enabling this all the links i tested worked flawlessly on the first try this is a quick comparison showing you how it will look with and without this service as you can see, when we have Real Debrid enabled, we now get a new line that shows all the available premium links. This is depicted by the image on the right. Premium links will either display Real Debrid or RD so you know which ones to use. You are guaranteed to have a lot more links with Real Debrid than you would without it. As you can see, the one on the left has 35 links, the one on the right has 63, and I am sure at least one of those will work. Once a video starts playing, you can check the quality to make sure you are getting the correct resolution for the link you chose. You can do this by selecting settings, select video settings, and right next to video stream, you can see the quality. So 1920 by 808. If the video was full screen, it would be 1920 by 1080, but you get the idea. You can close and continue to watch your video. This is just a way for you to see if the service is worth it for you or if you'd rather stay without it. Now we'll move on to the setup. Most add-ons already support Real Debrid. All you need to do is set it up in the settings. For this example, I will be using Incursion. First, make sure to head over to the link in the description and pay for the plan that you want. You'll notice it is way less than what you would pay on Netflix every month. After you have your account set up, you want to highlight the add-on that you will be using and then you want to bring up the context menu. This will be different depending on your device. If you have a keyboard, you press C. If you have a Fire TV, you press the menu button. And for other devices, just press whatever key you can until you get this menu here. You want to select settings. On the left side, you want to go down to accounts, move to the right and go down until you see debit service. You should see resolve URL settings, which will be used to configure real debrid. So go ahead and select it. From here, you want to select universal resolvers, move to the right and scroll down until you see real debrid and select reauthorize my account. You want to follow the instructions on the screen. Once you have done that, the message will disappear and you are ready to go. That's pretty much it. You now have Real Debrid enabled and can enjoy premium links displayed, which you can see here from the device that did not have it configured earlier. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button, subscribe for more videos like this, and make sure to check out my website for tutorials such as installing Incursion, which we used in this video, or any other add-ons you might find on there. Without further ado, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.